From the shores of Lake Erie and Northeast Ohio, it's time for Cleveland at Night. Cleveland at Night proudly presents a half of a movie. With special guest host, the unknown Annoying Comet. Tonight's flick, Voodoo, Black, Exorcist. And now, here's a special guest host of Cleveland at Night, a half of a movie, The Unknown Annoying Comet. at night a half of a movie. Whatever, whatever, whatever. Well, everybody's stuck at home for the last three months with this corona crap, COVID-19, whatever they call it. That's horrible. Just horrible. Where, where did it start it from? What, China? China started this, this, this epidemic all over the world? Well, I'm going to get my lawyers shyster and shyster and sue the Chinese government because I lost a lot of gigs in April, May, and June. It's horrible. Just horrible. This Chinese government, I'm going to sue them. Yeah, all right. I, you, you, can't, you can't trust a Chinese guy anyway. Hey, I have a thing out there. How do you blind a Chinese guy? <laughs> okay, One more okay. time. How do you blind a Chinese guy? You put dental floss over his eyes. <laughs> <laughs> All right, it's time for Cleaver, a half a movie. Like always, sit back, grab a snack and a beverage, relax, and enjoy it. I'll be back with more of the unknown annoying comic guest host of Cleaver, a half of a movie. <laughs> oh, these are big funny. Lights out. And now the movie, Oh! 
or something. Freddy, you will stay and watch over the sarcophagus. You will have to sleep here, too. I'm sorry, but it's necessary. Sophia, how long have you been working for me? As your secretary for three years and as your companion for two. Why don't we get married? The Caribbean is perfect for a honeymoon. Ah, accompanied by a mummy? I don't think it will bother us. Oh, don't you think we're all right as we are? What do we have to change things for? What chain did you say you had? Establishment war. Barbados, Curacao, the Virgin Island, the best hamburgers in the world. I uh, have a slaughterhouse in Chicago. That's very interesting. You're a dancer? Can you tell her? Your husband? Oh, he isn't my husband. He'll soon all get tired of him. He's always jealous. He's right to be. Tonight, the cards speak in a strange form. You know what it means? Violence. Blood. I can't believe you're serious. Don't you believe in cards? <laughs> in the 20th century, you can only believe in science, don't you think? Incredible. This card predicts an unexpected visitor. On the high seas? There's no mistake about it. women at.
us to rest in it eternally. I'll do my best, honey. Do you want us to open it? No. Why not? It would be dangerous. We should not do it. Miss, this sarcophagus has been opened on several occasions already. Johnny, don't let them. Oh. Tell them what could happen. Them. Let's go. I warn you, don't do it. What foolish superstitions, as nice and educated as the dead are, right, Albert? Uh, yes, dear. Observe that it can be opened from the inside as well as from the outside. How marvelous! <laughs> must have been a very interesting man. His story is written in these printings, but we haven't deciphered them yet. Notice his ring, made in the shape of an asp. It contains bits of carare that activate at 98.6 degrees, the blood temperature. It's pure gold, and its value is incalculable. Cleveland at night, a half a movie with special guest host, the unknown annoying comic. Of a movie. <laughs> <laughs> Whee! 
Yeah, baby! <laughs> Seven. You can see the future. I wouldn't want to bet against you. If you try, number four will come out three times. Do you know what that means? What does it mean? That someone will have their vengeance. You still have a chance. Shoot. Who are you? What do you want? You'll know soon. Shoot. You killed it. You totally murdered it. I'm gonna make him an offer he can't refuse. Night, you gave it to me. So that I could make a copy of the signs on the sarcophagus. You wouldn't think that I, I went back to the sarcophagus, do you? I can assure you that the crime was committed with that knife. But by whom? And why? I told you someone had been in my cabin. I heard him close to me. Sylvia, why did you go to the sarcophagus? I don't know. But what did you feel? At first I was trembling. I tell you, I... I tried very hard to regain control of my body. I was being pushed by a strange force. Now I feel, I feel I'm still waiting. For what? My own death.
Your killer is dead. I bring proof of my vengeance, O oh, Kenya, most beloved of women. Time. Time to go get a stack from your kitchen. It's refreshment time. And our refreshment stand is loaded with good things to eat. There's crispy, crunchy popcorn. And hot, delicious, buttered popcorn. Lots of candy. And frosty, refreshing, cold drinks. Why not treat yourself at the refreshment center now? As you leave the theater, folks, please be careful. Hey, 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 ho, ho, ho. Okay, the unknown annoying comic back here. I hope you enjoy the movie. It's intermission time. It's time to go to your kitchen and get another snack. I got some mixed nuts for all you nutty Cleveland Coopers. Cleveland Coopers out there. Oh, once again, we'll be back with the movie after this real nice mixed nut snack. Let's open it up for you, gang. I gotcha, gotcha. Warm back to the movie. Ho, ho, ho. <laughs> refreshing cold drinks. Why not treat yourself at the refreshment center now? As you leave the theater, folks, please be careful. Don't let this happen to your car. Be sure to remove the speaker before you leave. If you should accidentally pull a speaker loose, Please turn it in at our snack bar or box office. Thank you. You're watching Cleveland at Night, a half of a movie. Cleveland at Night, keeping a Cleveland tradition alive. Cleveland at Night can be seen Thursdays at 9 o'clock on Cleveland Spectrum Cable, Digital Channel 196, and Cox Cable 45. Also, visit our Facebook page, Danny K slash DMK TV Shows. Look for the picture of ship, and that's the right Facebook page. Also, like us on Facebook page and watch all Cleveland at Night Show and DMK production shows on cable. This episode of Cleveland at Night, a half a movie, our special guest host, the unknown annoying comic. The ship's about ready to sail, Dr. Kessling. Your colleague from New York? Whee! Dr. Craig, Mr. Dominguez. Whee! I hope we have no more incidents. Maybe we'll meet again in Port-au-Prince. Gentlemen. But Dr. Kessling and I disagree with you on your theory of the pantheism of the voodoo religion. Whee! They never invoke a single god. Rain or shine, good or bad, all depends on the Loas. We know nothing. The Loas are intercessors between men and God. God is lost in the universe and can't be invoked. He's only a threat. That's not what you said in your last book. However, that's how it is. In infinite time, what must happen, happens. I trust you won't do such a thing again. We had an agreement. I kept my part. You just see that you keep yours. Last night, I lost Rada's sacred ring. I want you to find who has it. Where are you going? Whee! Someone's thoughts call to me. It's like I picked the wrong week to quit smoking. Do you feel I am different? In a way, yes. You will see that I am not. The sea is beautiful, isn't it? Yes, it is. 
However, there are many creatures in the center of the earth that have never seen it. Imagine how they'd feel if put here now. That's how I felt when I found you again. You have a way of courting a woman. That's not my intention. You said something about finding me again. Had we met before? In Cairo's archaeological museum. You and Dr. Kessling were looking at the sarcophagus that you have now. Something wrong? No. No. Go away. Could be a modern art masterpiece. A terrible monster was right, right here. Nonsense. From Cleveland, Ohio, you're watching a half a movie with special guest host, the unknown annoying comic. You are watching the Odd Channel. Good food, cheap, cooked cheap. <laughs> Ingredients 
in there. We got our Kleeberg lettuce from Giant Pigeon Grocery Store. We got our seasoning. We put our ripe and unripe cherry tomatoes in there. We toss it up. It's all ready to go. Now, the last and most important ingredient and step is the way you toss the perfect toss salad. And we're going to do it to you folks right here. This is the way you toss a salad. Here we go. Wow. What the heck's going on? I got one of the crew members. <laughs> I'm gonna get you back. I'm gonna get you back. I'm gonna sue you. I'm gonna sue you. Shut the door and come and kill dummy. That was a feature presentation of the Odd Channel. Good food cheap, cook cheap. My advice to you, start drinking heavily. glows like a newborn star. I know that, having lost you for a thousand years. I could not find another like you until I find you again. Kenya, my only love. Beautiful poem. Who wrote it? Someone many years ago, alone on a beach. One night when the gods allowed him a few seconds of happiness. It's, uh, it's the translation of the inscriptions carved on the inside of the sarcophagus. Does Dr. Kessling know you've already translated the inscriptions? Dr. Kessling has many things to learn. And so do you. Me? You say that is a threat. Threats are only words. Whee! But what must happen is almost here and nothing can change it. But you have nothing to fear. Dr. Kissling. How are you? Terrible, moody, perplexed. <laughs> <laughs> it's so damn hot here, don't oh, you think? Yes. Uh, any news on the death of the steward? I've established that someone on board did it. Oh, yeah. Logic, huh? Yes. The other case we have is worse. It was terrible. The day you arrived, the passenger from flight 704 was run over. He was killed? Yes, a bulldozer. No identification. By the way, you went to the airport to meet a passenger from that flight, didn't you? Yes, Dr. Craig. But I assure you, he was very much alive. Dr. Craig? There he is. Did you know him? Why, yes, of course. I won't bother you. I'll just wait. For an error, a false step. Anyhow, it's too damn hot to do anything. Don't you think? We'll meet again, Dr. Kessling. Adios, Inspector. Okay, I picked the wrong week to quit sniffing glue. 
Now you're talking strange. Why do you look at me? It's the only Whee! way I know how. Sylvia, I can't get used to calling you that. On the shop, my name should be. What's that top? Kenya. I don't think we should show the mummy to the public. But you know that people want to see that. Dr. Kathleen, we will be on the air in half an Thank hour. Thank you. Sylvia, if you had a very interesting scientific truth in your hands, how much would you be willing to pay? You absolutely cannot buy them. You can only discover them. this guy on Cleveland's own News Watch 9 tonight.
Would you please keep the camera focused on the sarcophagus? Yes, sure. Do it. Hey, why is that still there? Dr. Kessling has the second part of his conferences tomorrow. Looks like he doesn't want the mummy to get away. You stay here. And let me know if anything happens. Like what? You'd never know, son. You'd never know. Now listen. Don't take your eyes off this sarcophagus. You understand? It is a virus 50 times smaller than any virus produced until now. It reproduces every three seconds. It's absolutely unfilterable. We have completed the strontium-70 test and it can now produce blood poisoning in 30 seconds. Thanks, son. Would you like to hear something absurd? Mm. Love to. This blood sample is a thousand years old. A thousand? Inspector, Dr. Kessling's helper is trying to open the sarcophagus. What? Stop him? I'm afraid it's too late. He took the chain off. He said not to shoot, no matter what. Shoot who? Whatever or whoever comes out of the sarcophagus. What can come out of a sarcophagus? night a half of a movie with special guest host the unknown annoying comic
Tonight Show. No, it's Cleveland at night. Who? Whatever, whatever, whatever. Hey, the Cleveland at night show is sweeping <laughs> east side and west side of Cleburg, Ohio. <laughs> hey, I'm gonna tell you one thing out there. What's the difference between a rich east side couple and a canoe? <laughs> think about it. East side rich couple and a canoe. What's the difference? What's the difference? A canoe tips. Oh, 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 oh. Hey, oh shut up. You can't fool me up the unknown annoying comment. Hey, what do you call a west side couple? Like it's from Parma on Prospect Avenue. That's right. What do you call a Parma couple in Prospect Avenue? Lost. <laughs> oh, shut up, you Cleveland kooks. Now it's time for a skit. And back to the movie, I'll be back later, gang. Hey ho, 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 hey, ho, 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 ho. Are you a first time caller? Yes, I am. What is the month and year you were born? I need to know your sign. You are the psychic, you tell me. You, go that way. You, on that side. Remember, don't use your guns unless in self-defense or when I order to use this. Yes, sir. Do you know what a mummy is, my son? No, sir. At first, you will think it's a human being like you or me. But later, you will realize it's not. And that's when you would tremble. Yes, sir. But that is the time you will have to pull the trigger. Hurry, hurry. You won't destroy it. If I take it home, my wife will get very angry. But Inspector, you can't do that. We have to keep it alive. Don't make trouble. We've got quite enough of it right now. And try to help us.
My advice to you is to start drinking heavily. Dr. Craig, Dr. Craig, where are you? I want to help you. What is that idiot doing? He's going to spoil everything. Dr. Craig. Where are you? Answer me. for watching Cleveland at Night, a half a movie. Cleveland at Night, keeping a Cleveland tradition alive. Don't forget, Cleveland at Night can be seen on Thursdays, Cleveland Spectrum Cable at 9 o'clock on Digital Channel 196 and Cox Cable. Also like our Facebook page.